T minus 90 seconds and counting. All systems are go. That rocket is blowing up in my pockets. Uh, just look at my balance, more zeros, I'm about to double my racks. Uh, look at my bank account, I'm about to get rich. Uh, look at your bank account, tell me if you don't wish. Uh. It's your boy, Underdog Crypto, aka Jay, here with another cryptocurrency video. Today, we're taking a first look research review over a cryptocurrency project that you should learn about to see if we can blow up our bank accounts and always putting research over hype here's my disclaimer i am not a financial advisor and this video was created under the fair use act for educational purposes only and research i am a certified instructor Certified Digital Currency Investigator, a Certified Fraud Examiner, Certified Expert in Social Media Intelligence, Certified Expert in Cyber Investigations. Master of Science in Digital Forensics Management. We'll place the hood on the graduate. <laughs> I'm a Digital Forensic Scientist. Currently pursuing my PhD in technology and innovation management with a specialization in information systems. And I do all this to make sure I give you the best research possible to help you change your life. And today we're going to have a first look research review over Win NFT Horse, a cryptocurrency gamify project. Let's talk about this project. Before we do that, remember, before you look at any project, before you decide to go further, and especially before you put your hard-earned money on it, please ensure that you watch everything about this project and remove your bias. You don't want to get yourself in a position where you are in something that you truly don't want to be in. You only want to make sure that you are doing so after you have no shilling or fudding. You just want to get the research. With that being said, let's get started. A summary of this project, Win NFT Horse, Beyond the Infinity. Win FT Horse is a gamify, and gamify is a new buzz in cryptocurrency industry. It's bringing together decentralized finance, NFTs, and a practical application of blockchain technology to the gaming industry. There is currently a paradigm shift taking place as gamers move away from the traditional methods of traditional online games of pay to play, play to win, and moving toward the play to earn model and recently introduced by Gamify. Now, although early Gamify projects like Axie Infinity were built on the Ethereum blockchain, Tron has done the same thing here and it aims to improve upon this Gamify sector even further by offering faster times on the, this transaction speeds, offering lower transactions and better user experience. WinFT Horse is a DeFi NFT horse racing game created by Tron in a collaboration with Ape NFT and Wink Link. Now, Win NFT Horse brings more closely at the concept of play to earn and a new hold to earn, hold to play, and play to earn platform is attempting to redefine the meaning of Gamify. Unlike many other NFT games, Win NFT Horse is designed to allow all players to gain financially from the game without gaining anything themselves. Anyone can enjoy Win NFT Horse through fun gameplay as well as earn token rewards for their contributions to the ecosystem. Players can do this by breeding, racing, collecting, buying, and selling their NFT horse. The identity and the utility. I had to show you and identify what this is regarding this game. Let's talk about that. 
in 2021 global game market you can see here that nfts and the global game market hit 93.2 billion dollars of that is broken down in tablet games smartphone games box and downloaded pc games console games and browser pc games now if you look at this this is a huge aspect of money that is being dumped into the gaming industry in 2021 alone with 93 billion dollars now where did they get this information from the 93 billion dollars are revenues that encompass the consumer spending on games this is physical and digital full game copies in-game spending subscription services like xbox game pass mobile revenues excluding advertising estimates include uh, taxes secondhand trade secondary markets advertising revenues earned in and around games consoles and peripheral hardware these are the various ways they got those figures when nft horse though encompasses a few things that you need to know first let's talk about it tron 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 is a project that is all about decentralization the ecosystem that nft horse is on are twofold now first you need to know that nft horse the game is built on the Tron network, but not only Tron work network, but recently they have built this game on Binance. This is the IGO, initial gaming offer. Typically, we're used to seeing the initial coin offer, but with the initial gaming offer, this was the first introduction to the largest platform in the world for cryptocurrency Binance and you can play this game on Binance now in that ecosystem we got to go further and break it down you have the ape NFT tokens you use wink tokens and you use Tron tokens now the ape NFT tokens helps you to power up and give your horses different abilities such as speed endurance etc Wink tokens also give special access and privileges, and you can win these tokens. These are used together on the network. Some of the positive things that I saw about the project. Well, let's talk about this. New York Times releases recently an article talking about digital racehorses and how they are the talk of the crypto world. They use a particular project called Zed Run and I want to read this to you. Zed Run, this was released last year, is an Australian made online platform where it all it takes is to get you a horse and it describes itself as a fair digital horse racing game built on blockchain technology. Trading digital horses, racing them to win prize money, breeding them and make new ones are all possible in this strange new utopia called the metaverse. Now this play to earn gaming model is taking off. Now let's talk about what is taking off, the positive aspects of this racing gaming model. There are now over 15,000 stable owners at the time in which that video was done and this article was discussed and that was about May of 2021 with some horses selling for an eye-watering $125,000. Now, since that time, so you know, I talked about this in an earlier video, that those horses are sold out. You can't get a horse. Now, some of the famous people that you want to know about, maybe, are in this particular type of thing, is uh, comedians, such, and rappers like Ja Rule, Mike Tyson, are among a few of the people who own horses and stables for this game. Now, going back to this particular project that we're talking about today this came after zed run and would be considered a competitor if you're comparing horse games that race however it's on a network of tron network of binance and so it's really another game in the same space but let's talk about the economy within this how do you make money well, let's talk about this briefly in an overview. One of the ways 
is you have a horse. And here I show you the economics of this game. You have a marketplace. In that marketplace, you can buy a horse. This is an NFT horse. That horse is unique and has special features. You can buy another horse, a male and a female horse, and you can breed them to reproduce another new NFT. And that horse can be sold. Any of your horses can be sold. So the first way to make money is to buy a horse. There's 10 different types of horses currently at the time when this video was done. And then to sell one of your horses or reproduce a horse and then sell that horse. The second way is to use your horse in the game to win. You don't have to do anything to win other than participate and have a horse. So your entry is the ability to buy a horse. If you participate in this game, there's a various amount of daily tokens that you get for free. You play to earn these tokens. So that is two ways in this ecosystems that you get those tokens. Now, step four of the process in which we review these projects is talk about the challenges. Well, let me tell you some of the challenges I saw. There are three to four steps to get started with this game. I showed you here, and this is off of their website. So when you go to get this game, you have to create a Tron wallet link. You have to also get a horse. You have to download the game. And there's also different settings you have to set. I would love to report to you that this was all easy peasy. It seemed easy enough. However, a, one of the challenges I found is not paying attention to small details that weren't truly explained very well that prohibited me from getting onto the game as quickly as I could. Ultimately, after trial and error, I was able to overcome it, but it was with a challenge. This has to be corrected if there's going to be large turnouts and easy consumption from the masses as most people already have a challenge with getting on cryptocurrency add to it technological difficulties will be a challenge for this project if not corrected I am going to because of this create a how-to video that will be after this video is posted so that you can walk with me through the process step by step to help you out so that if you would like to get started with a project such as this, or maybe a different project, you will know how to do so to help you out. Now, another thing is the legal political aspect. That's another part of research we should look at. And looking at the legal political aspect, I got to mention taxes. This is an article recently posted about two days ago, and it says, NFT investors owe billions in taxes and the IRS sets sites on evaders. Non-fungible tokens market exploded last year, and that's 2021, to $44 billion. And Uncle Sam, and this is for the United States folks, is trying to collect, but the tax rules aren't clear. Keep in mind, I am not a financial advisor, and as I said, this is not financial advice, but one thing I know, whether you're in the United States or other places, there is a gray area when it comes to NFTs and how that works uh, with the general accepted uh, practices and how, what you need to do, the taxes. You need to understand if you're in the crypto market, then all of this may have taxes on it, depending on your jurisdiction, and you must find a way to make sure that you take care of those taxes. So keep that informed as you decide if you want to get into flipping these horses are playing these games. It's not just fun anymore. There's money involved. Facts and FUD. I did find some facts and FUDs, but the great thing about it is this project went ahead and addressed the FUD. And what did they do? Well, here is the FUD. I'm going to read you this off their social media channel from January 12th of 2022. This is what the project said. There are rumors going around recently regarding the NFT withdrawal of Win NFT Horse, so we would like to make this announcement to get it cleared up. Due to the popularity of this game, the volume of NFT withdrawal requests is way more than anticipated. 
The original withdrawal system was overwhelmed, so we developed an automatic withdrawal and risk control system, which is the testing phase currently. It is expected that the backlog of withdrawals will be processed in eight hours. Hopefully, it will process all the backlogs in 48 hours. Thank you so much for your trust and support. Now, what they're talking about there is there was FUD, and that goes with being in new territory. People were having difficulty getting their tokens that they won in this play-to-earn game off of the site. Now, of course, if I don't know what's going on, I can see how this would make me feel negative. Now, this FUD was actually true. The project addressed the FUD, which I always think is a positive sign, and said, yes, you were having difficulties because we didn't expect the overwhelming looking for people to find this game this exciting to play. We wasn't looking or expecting this overwhelming outcome. And so because of that overwhelming outcome, our systems were not able to handle the load. So we're correcting the issue. And they did correct the issue and people were happy from what I could research. So this is no longer an issue. Well, that is all I have. There is no more that I have to talk about in regarding the first look at Win NFT Horse. I want you to take a look and check it out. See if you like the project. Look at my previous videos on Ape NFT. The first one, the second one, the third one, the fourth one. And for my members only who do subscribe with my members only platform releases, I will have a full standard review about this project. This is the first review so that you can get an overview of this project. Well, I hope you enjoyed it, folks, and I'm going to leave you with Indigo Saint. And until next time, this has been your boy, Underdog Crypto. I hope you got that. I hope you got that PR, though. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey. That rocket is intimate to my pockets. Counting the zeros, my GM just waiting to rain in the racks. Uh, yeah. That rocket is blowing up in my pockets. Uh, just look at my balance, no zeros, I'm about to double my racks. Uh, yeah. That rocket is intimate to my pockets. Uh, counting the zeros, my GM just waiting to rain in the racks. Uh, yeah. That rocket is blowing up in my pockets. Uh, just look at my balance, no zeros, I'm about to double my racks. Yeah. Uh, look at my bank account, I'm about to get rich. Uh. Look at your bank account, tell me if you don't wish, uh I said that I get it now, I said that I get it, I got it now PR be blowing my bank account, it really ain't safe for work Cause I ain't going back, you tell my boss and I'll call me back, uh T-minus 90 seconds and counting